What's good, y'all? It's Cliff Mega. This video is about eating potatoes in the winter is the best. Now, the reason for this was, well, and I know, like, y'all like eating potatoes. But yes, you should eat your food according to the season. The reason why I eat potatoes, especially during around this time in the winter time, it builds up that acid in your stomach to keep you warm. Now, when it's heading towards the ending of March, depending on where you're living at, that's when you want to go stop eating potatoes and start to begin your fast. Get all that out your system whatsoever. And this doesn't take away from, you know, claim your climate whatsoever. If you're in a cold climate, New York and all these places and over here, you know, in the States, yes, you need to eat like starchy food whatsoever. But during that cold winter time, that helps keep your body warm. When it's going into, like I said, spring, which in spring here is kind of, like I said, it's like late March. Then you want to take a fast. You want to do that fast, that three-day, that one-week fast. Depends on your body. Everybody's body is different. So eating potatoes, yes, the benefits of eating potatoes in the wintertime is it keeps you warm. You eat potatoes, bread, all these starchy stuff. And if, you know, other people that eat meat, this will be great for you because that acid kicks up. And it keeps your inside warm, especially if you're somebody that works outside, like myself. I work outside, so I need that whatsoever. Not the meat, but the potatoes and the bread. Yes, that type of stuff, man. I throw in the falafels up in there. Yeah. But, um, of course, my joint is always, um, if you're living in a warm climate, then no. There's no reason for you to eat potatoes. There's really no benefit in it because... It's not really giving your body anything like that whatsoever. It gives your body a lot of heat. Well, you know what? <sighs> Let me rephrase that a little bit. Every When you eat something whatsoever, you might eat something and it might give you a benefit different than me because so when I learn about with it and this health, all of us have, um, all of us are different blood types. And depending on your blood type, what food is going to go good for you. This is why with all the confusion about you know, taking this DNA test and finding out um, if we was right where we supposed to be at, you know, in our climate, eating our food, we would never have to experience eating potatoes or probably all this other stuff, whatever. And it's not that, like, potatoes couldn't make it over, because like I told you, I went to Jamaica and found out about, you know, the noni, the noni grows over there. Somebody brought it over to um, Belize. Now Noni grows in Belize. Why? Because the climate is the same like Jamaica. Same salt water, all that whatsoever. So, these things, you know, as people, we're traveling, taking these things, different part. But like I said, these things only grow in this climate. So, in your climate, you should eat what your climate has, whatever. Like I said, in New York, for a winter climate, you need to eat starchy food. Yes, because you also need acid in your stomach as well. You need that acid to break down stuff. You know, it pushes minerals, it pushes vitamins and everything where it needs to go. That's what your acid is for, whatever. The best time, like I said, for in the winter time, you um drink your water first, your alkaline water first, especially if you're, you know, doing physical work. You need that. That'll give you a jump start then to be drinking coffee. Or if, like I told you, I had this thing, I was taking Garden of Life, but they don't promote it no more. They had a coffee, and the coffee was organic, non-GMO. That was pretty good to take with whoever. A lot of this synthetic coffee that they have out there in them stores in New York, I, I choose not to mess with it. But the benefits, like I said, of the potatoes, yes. In a cold, cold climate, yes, you should eat the potatoes. I'm not going to say no. Yes to potatoes in a cold climate. When it's getting warm, now it's time to fast the potatoes out of your body. Depending on you, it might take a week. For me, it usually takes three days to four days when I do a cleanse, whatever, and I'm good. I mean, on an overall scale to get everything, yes, I would have to do about a month um, fast, whatever, to get everything out whatsoever. But to just get my body like back on point to doing what I need to do, it only takes me about a three-day fast and I'm good to go. So, anyway, I hope this helps somebody out. And like I said, eat according to the climate whatsoever. Eat, you know, wintertime, eat that starchy food. When it's coming into spring, when the food is start coming up, 
yeah, you can eat these greens. You can eat these fruits and stuff. And to me, as it gets hotter, like in summer, I don't even know if I would mess with greens too much. I would just straight eat fruits, just be a fruitarian, like just straight eat fruits because it has a lot of water in it. Anyway, lady up.